Okay. My name is Mrs. Conradi, and I am the art teacher at the grade school, and I was just going to go over how we are going to do art for the next um, nine weeks. So every week you will get an art choice board from your teacher that I have sent to them to send to you guys. Um, and it says, please pick two a week. Boards may change from week to week. Please pick a different project each time. If you or your kid really, really like a project and want to redo it, I'm perfectly fine with that. Um, just don't let them keep using, do the same one all the time because I know kids, they, they love to free draw, which I have down here, um, but they really need to try some other things rather than just free draw all the time. So um, there's six boxes they can pick from, plus the free draw is always going to be an option. The reason the free draw is always an option, in case I have students who don't have any materials, paper, pencil materials, anything but paper and pencil at home. So no, no paints, no markers, no nothing. Um, this is a good option for them. I will always keep one option. So right now it's my letter project option as a paper pencil project. So they can pick the letter project and free draw if you don't have any art supplies at home. Now I suggest if you have art supplies at home, you do some of these other ones because they're actually really fun. Um, some of them the kids can do by themselves. Some of them they may need help. Um, I would just watch your video with your kid or watch the video before you give it to the kid. And most of them are super easy and they're fun to do and you probably want to try them anyways. So. Um, I hope you guys have fun with this. They need to pick um, two a week, and so every time they get a new board, they'll get new projects. Um, some of the projects I may leave on there if no one did them, so that way they can have a second chance to do them. If you guys want to do all six in a week and because you're looking for stuff to do, that is perfectly fine too. But I suggest um, just trying to do two. So when you're all done, I would like to take a picture of your project and send it to your teacher using Class Dojo, so that way we can all enjoy what you did. Okay. So if you look at the art choice boards, it'll tell you the project um, name. It'll tell you the materials you need, so that way you know beforehand what you're going to need and if you can even do the project because you may not have the materials. Then there'll be a video link right down here. Right now I don't have any of the video links so there's none there. But what you would do is just click on it and it would take you to the YouTube video of me walking them through each step to do their project. And it's just like we would do in class except they're just watching me on video and doing it on their own. If you have any questions you guys can email me at Melissa dot conready at usd215.org. I'll be happy to help you in any way I can. Or you can um, message your teacher on Class Dojo and they can get a hold of me if needed. I hope that you guys have fun and that this doesn't become something that you have to do but that's something that you want to do because these are actually really fun for a whole family affair. I hope you have a great nine weeks, and remember, you can always get a hold of me if needed. Thanks.